Hello Aquarius, thank you so much for checking out this video. This is going to be your message. This will be a love reading. It'll be uh, general, so it will not resonate with every Aquarius out there. Just keep that in mind. If it doesn't resonate, it just wasn't your reading for today, and you can check out your other placements to see if those readings resonate more with you. I'm going to be pulling from this deck. I Full disclosure, I have taken out several cards from each of these decks so that they can be easier to shuffle and also i wanted to take out anything that wasn't very clear or didn't really fit like a relationship reading so just full disclosure these two decks are the enchanted map and energy oracles spirit please what messages does aquarius need to know in regards to love whoa okay i had a flying card hang on one second First card out is spark. Interesting. So this could be like an instant attraction. It could be lust at first sight or love at first sight. There's an instant connection here with spark. What else do we have for my Aquarius? This reading will be for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Energies can be vice versa, so I could be talking about you or the other person. And time is fluid, so just keep in mind that this could have already happened, be currently happening, or happen in the near future. Spirit, what messages does Aquarius need to know in regards to love? Messages for Aquarius. Messages you have for Aquarius mountain okay so this is all about an obstacle finding a different path around something looking at a situation differently thank you and we have man holding a heart even though there's a man here this could also be a woman um i, I see this card more as masculine energy and we all have masculine and feminine so um this is someone definitely offering you love here interesting okay so let's see what the tarot has to say i'm going to use two decks today spirit what messages do you have for my aquarius sun moon rising and venus messages regarding love for aquarius what does aquarius need to know in regards to love what does aquarius need to know well Okay, I'm starting off with three cards, which I didn't want to do. I always am aiming to have one card come out and it never happens. Okay, Page of Swords. Someone has an eye on someone here. Eight of Cups, walking away towards something new. And Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands is really making me think about this Spark card. So I have someone who's watching, someone who's walking away, and someone who's rushing in. Very interesting. Um, I feel like for some of you, this is someone you already know with Page of Swords. There's definitely chemistry here. There's mutual attraction and also there's movement. Someone is has walked away from something, is walking away from something or will be. Um, I also find it interesting that in this uh, photo here for the Eight of Cups, you have mountains. So it's almost like with the mountain car, someone's walking through an obstacle is what I'm getting here. I am going to clarify all of these, but right away I see, you know, spying on social media, trying to send DMs or messages back and forth, or just wanting to talk and communicate. I have someone here who wants to rush in for sure. Spirit, please, one card, please, if possible. <laughs> one card for my Aquarius. Oh my gosh, and of course I get like four. All right, I'm not gonna fight with my cards today. Five of Pentacles, Chariot, again with the movement here. The Fool, a new beginning of some sort, and the Sun. So that's a great way to end this um, initial reading. I feel like you're moving towards something new for sure. 
I feel like you're walking away from this Five of Pentacles energy. Someone has been left out in the cold or feels abandoned or has gone through some sort of hardship or has had to like carry a burden on their own is what I feel like. But most more than anything, I just feel like someone has been shut out or just been alone, isolated, But there's victory here. There's movement, possibly with a Cancer, Aries, Leo. Um, they could have that in their chart, but it doesn't really matter. More, more than anything, I'm seeing that you're moving towards something new that's going to make you very happy. And I think it's this connection. I think you also felt a spark with someone. Oops. Oh my gosh. You also felt a connection with someone. Um, and you want to move forward on this. Let's clarify. Spirit, help me clarify for my Aquarius. My beautiful Aquarius. Okay, let's start with this Page of Swords. Okay, right away. Knight of Cups, Two of Cups. Definitely someone's watching you because they want to make an offer. They want to talk about this connection, this spark that they feel with you for sure. Tell me about this Eight of Cups for Aquarius. Oh my God, my cards are going crazy. OMG, okay. Ten of Pentacles, Death, and the Sun. So we have the Sun here um, twice. Death makes sense to me because you're walking away. You could be walking away from a long-term commitment or you could be walking towards a long-term commitment, something that makes you very happy. Could be dealing with a Scorpio as well or someone with Scorpio in their chart. But more than anything, I'm getting that someone is walking away towards their happiness. Tell me about this Knight of Wands. That is way too many. Tell me about the Knight of Wands for Aquarius. What's this Knight of Wands about? Strength card, so another Leo here. Someone is, the, right away I'm getting bravery, courage. Someone's taking a chance here. Tell me about the Five of Pentacles. Tell me about the Five of Pentacles. Thank you. Wheel of Fortune, changes, interesting. I feel like divine timing has played a role in how this has played out for you, Aquarius. The wheel has turned, so nothing can remain the same again. Um, I feel, I very strongly, I'm feeling there's an end to this feeling abandoned, left out in the cold. Like, that's going to change. It's almost like the divine has stepped in to change this and give you something new. Tell me about the chariot. Tell me about the chariot for Aquarius, please. Oh my gosh. The chariot is clarified by the chariot. <laughs> Thank you, spirit. <laughs> I really do feel though, like um, I love when this happens in readings, just confirmation about what spirit wants to communicate. I feel like you're moving away from this three of swords energy. I have three of swords at the bottom of the deck here. You're moving towards victory, success, moving forward to something new. Tell me about the fool. Tell me about the fool for Aquarius, please. What's this fool about? Oh my God. Oh my God. Clarify about the fool. What is happening? This is crazy. I'm sorry. I've never had this happen to me like back to back like that the fool is clarified by the fool and you will not believe what's at the bottom of the deck are you ready eight of cups <laughs> i love when this happens this is the craziest reading i've ever done <laughs> but i love it because the message is clear this is something new so i don't see this as a reunion with someone from your past or anything like that um this is something new if you are in a uh, committed relationship, I feel like this is a completely new way of doing whatever you've been doing with your relationship. 
when the wheel turns, there's no going back. Tell me about the sun. If the sun comes out, I swear, I will faint. <laughs> okay. Page of Cups. As long as it's not the sun. <laughs> okay, so Page of... Well, actually, why am I saying that the sun's over here? Oh my god. I cannot. Hold on, guys. Let me just get it together. Someone's coming in with an offer. I have the Knight of Cups, Page of Cups here. I have the Knight of Wands. This is very clear to me. Ten of Pentacles. This is someone with really good intentions. Someone that wants to do things right with you here with the Page of Cups and the Sun. I really do feel like this union is going to make you very happy, Aquarius. It's like you're getting... Um, you're getting someone that's going to take you out of this five of pentacles energy you're not you're it's going to be a completely new new relationship for you it's going to be a complete new phase of your life here with the wheel of fortune and the death card nothing's going to be the same and i think that's for the best so i'm going to leave it there thank you so much if you guys um have liked shared or subscribed my video to, to my videos um or i should say to my channel Thank you so much, everybody. I love your comments. Everybody has been so supportive and I really appreciate it. Um, if this resonated with you, please let me know down in the comments what this is all about. If it did not resonate with you, that's okay. It just wasn't your reading this time around. Um, check out your other placements for more messages and I'll see you guys in my next one.